Hello, hello. Today we're gonna to be making some Birch Benders pancakes, and this is actually for lunch. So we are going to start off um, with three quarters of a cup of the pancake mix, and it's also a waffle mix for those that don't know. This is the first time I'm actually trying them, so I'm very excited. I'm gonna do a little bit of leavening. We can remove some of the excess and have a bit more exact measurements there. If you're enjoying this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And then instead of water, I am using some milk. I love for my pancakes to be fluffy and filling, so I'm going to add that. And I added two thirds of a cup of that, which was the suggested water amount. Now we're going to mix, mix, mix really well so that we can get that nice, smooth pancake consistency. We're gonna coat our pan with um, one of the best butters out there, Kerrygold. Love it. Tried it for the first time in Ireland when I studied abroad. You can check out some of those videos on my channel. And then comes the fun part, um, pouring and starting to make the pancakes. And it was at this point that I realized that they had stuck together. So here we go, my attempt at trying to separate them. After we made the pancakes, um, I started making some eggs, a little bit of scrambled eggs in the same pan. Didn't want any more dirty dishes. Move, move, move. Make it a little bit more fluffy. Alrighty, so then now we add some of this maple syrup. And we chop up some fruit. I chose strawberries this time around. And if you thought it was done, it was not. I love salsa on my eggs. Of course, the first bite for the salsa. And eggs, so yummy. And actually one of the pancakes I forgot to mention, I added some chocolate chips. And that's the one I'm trying first. And yeah, it was pretty good. Now we're trying the plain one with just the maple syrup, no chocolate chips. Did toss in a little bit of strawberries. But yeah, thank you so much for following along.